hey what's up guys welcome to another vlog with snap with chance this is your boy Neo once again today you guys are gonna have a look at a beautiful beautiful bmw e36 owned by zd yeah so what happened yesterday was we went to a music video shoot with chip yesterday uh, with three cars it was celebs coco and zd's car the e36 so what happened was uh, my friend came along with the shoot so he had my other small camera bag and when we had to come back there was a change of cars so unfortunately left the bag in the car so yeah today i'm at centurion i'm almost at zidi's place so yeah i just thought that we should just feature the car on the channel but yeah it's a beautiful e36 that's bag yeah i hope you guys are going to enjoy today's video before we go any further please make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel and yeah uh, let's go have some fun let's go look at zidi's bmw e36 I think the build was done at Chips Chase uh, Chicano's Customs. So yeah, peace. A few moments later. Yeah, I just made it over to Zidi's place. Yeah, I got my camera bag. Uh, but, <laughs> but yeah, uh, we're just waiting for him right now. He's a bit busy. Then yeah, we're gonna head outside and go talk about the beautiful E36 in a few. I know you guys might have saw it already on the thumbnail. But yeah, I hope you guys are ready and excited to see or hear the full story and history of the car. See you guys in a bit. Hey Zidi. Charles, man. I'm good, how are you? Good, man. Good, good. Please tell everyone who you are, where you're from, and yeah. Well, um, people, my name is Yad, people know me as Zidi. Um, I'm from Pretoria, Lodium. Yeah. I'm from where uh, your friend is Chup. Yeah. Chup Musa. <laughs> yeah. From a town where we're inspired by cars, okay. nice cars. Yeah. Uh, the town is known for nice cars. Yeah. People who own nice cars. Yeah. So yeah, that's where I'm from. So what do you have here today? I have uh, a 328 convertible. 1998 1998 model. model yeah this is a second owned car okay. uh, owned by my father yeah i know if i don't know if viewers will know who zayn musa is zayn musa zayn musa was a former Bafana oh. player yeah. played for sundowns yeah i'm sure um, most people know him yeah they know yeah. him they they people who they say just an older generation yeah, 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 yeah. people who like football yeah will know him. He's the owner of this guy and I just took over it and I just did what I like doing this. What's yeah. so yeah, yeah. right. um, He's had this car since 1999. Yeah. Well looked after. Um, very well looked after. Very well looked after. Yeah. The engine, you can't even mean, you can hear it now. Yeah. It's aging so low. It's, 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 and it's soft. Yeah. The car is soft. So like it. In that way, my father looked after the car. Always not a reckless driver. Yeah. Kept the car neat. Yeah. Kept the car clean. Over the years, he, uh, let's say, uh, as you get older, you lose interest in, in cars or so. Let's just say, not everyone does it, but... So at some point, he wanted to sell a car and I was like, nope. 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 There's no way you're doing that. There's no way you're doing that. <laughs> this guy is special. We've had it in the family all the years. Yeah. He's got it for since 1999, yeah, till now. So the guy is carrying on and I hope to yeah. keep it for my son, yeah. who is now three years old and hopefully old. he'll... Yeah, enjoy this car one day, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's nice, nice. All right, so from exterior wise, the, the car is white. Uh, has it been white ever since? Always, guys. Always white. This is a car you see. The car is east. Yeah. The car has been white. The car is. Uh, my father was very finicky on scratches. Yeah. <laughs> so on this car, you really see any scratches on the minor, car? Minor, minor scratches. Minor scratches on yeah. the car. Scratches you probably see the airline scratches. Yeah. Here and there you'll see. Because it's an old car. It's an old car. I feel like scratches and small, nitty-gritty stuff. Yeah give character to the car, to the car it's something uh, yeah. I've, in my opinion I, I feel it gives character to it and I also find it right. I appreciate the car more as well right, so right. there's a story to tell yeah so yeah. the car has never been painted before has it been painted no 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 the okay. car has never been resprayed before yeah but basically the reason why this car was so well maintained because my father really used to drive the car at some point yeah the car used to stand most of the time mm. um, then he started using the car as a daily All right. and then he stopped using the car at some point again and then this is how the car maintained itself All basically. Right. Yeah. yeah. But besides the, the paint, your wheels, the wheels are so beautiful. The wheels, uh, <laughs> nice wheels, wheels I put on recently, it's actually a month now on the car. A, so, a month on the car yeah. now, yeah. 
I had Napier Japans on them. Okay. Uh, these are PBS RS wheels, 17 inch. 17 inch wheels. Narrows and wide. Yeah. And the back is 9Js at the back. 9Js at the back. I feel like the look on this car, it sits a bit better. Yeah. With this wheel on. This, um, the Napiers were, they were nice. Yeah. They were different. But mm -hmm. uh, I felt this car needed more of an original look. Yeah, yeah. Give it, give it, give it and the BMW feel, it would, yeah. yeah. Definitely, definitely. Yeah, I like the, keep it like, sort of as like an old school old vibe school. to it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And what tire sizes on the 17? This is 185, 35, 35. 70. 17. Oh, wait. Hey, y'all, come look at this. 185, 40, 70. Yeah. yeah. Both front and back. Both front and back. All right. And suspension wise? Suspension, we've got air suspension, air suspension. Here, we've got the basic uh, Bluetooth yeah. air suspension done by Chicanos. Okay. The double bellow bags, yeah. uh, front end back. Front end back. The car is quite heavy, so it needs it. Yeah. There's uh, two compressors as well. Alright. Yeah, it's. Uh, so for me, for me the, the work done at Chicanos on the air suspension, I haven't had any issues. No issues? No. Uh, even though it's a basic remote control mm -hmm. uh, Bluetooth. Yeah. Yeah, I've never had any no issues, issues with whatsoever. it. No leaks. Yeah. Drive is quite soft. Yeah. Uh, makes the old school feel not so old school. Yeah. The new new school yeah, element. Got a new on school it. element on it. Yeah. In nice. terms of the drive, there's no bounce. So yeah. Drive is quite comfortable. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. And something that we notice is the the side mirrors. Are they OEM or? The mirrors are something? not OEM. Okay. The mirrors are actually a friend of mine in Lodium. I oh, yeah. helped me get these mirrors. I always wanted M3 mirrors. Yeah. We wanted to spray it white and make it look OEM. Yeah. But uh, we thought the black breaks the white a bit. Mm, okay. The feel of the black on the car. Yeah. So I said, no, I'll keep it this way. Keep it this way, no? Plus, it, it matches with the matches black with the beatings, yeah. yeah. M3 beatings. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, yeah, got the M3 front bumpers. Front bumper, too. Cool. Yeah. With the. Basically, what you see in front of a car is where all I did was change the bumpers, the fog lights, yeah. put the standard, uh, standard grill on. Basically, I kept the orange indicator, indicator lens, lenses just for that original feel. Yeah. Keep that old school feel old school going. Feel too. Yeah. Oh, but it's looking super, super clean. It also brings out the white in the car. The white in the car. I just thought about putting a white lens, yeah. indicator lens, but I thought it might be a bit too much. It no? might be a bit too much white, but it breaks it off a bit. So. Yeah. Yeah. Since we're in front, uh, can you maybe check out the engine bay? If it's yeah, the basic. engine bay, well, it's a. Uh, so the engine is basic, nothing done on it. I yeah. don't uh, have the. I don't feel like doing anything on it. Nothing on it. Huh? There's a 328. 328. The heart looks big. It, it, yeah, it's, 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 it's a big. big yeah. Yeah. The, the car moves. The it car moves. moves yeah. Super neat. I think it's big. Close to the M3. Well, it's not an M3. Yeah. But the uh, 2.8 are quite fast. It, it, I it, think it, it people moves. enjoy 328 as well. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. And it's sounding so soft. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't sound like it's no, no. Well, a driver it. like me, I'm, I'm not a hard driver. Yeah. I don't like spinning and stuff. Yeah. I don't like driving hard and shit. You're more of a cruiser than a uh, Yeah, I'm more of a cruiser. Speed. I like uh, I like style more than, than speed. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Comfort. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Then can we go into the interior now? Yeah. So this is a uh, brown vintage leather. Brown vintage leather. Brown vintage leather. This was also done by Chicanos Customs. Chicanos Customs. Right. The guys just know they work with interiors. Yeah. Uh, the guys in the background like Rasta and Endo and them. Yeah. They work at Chicanos, they they quite good in the This is actually hand stitched. Hand stitched. Yeah, uh, hand stitched. The design was um, part of Chip's idea also. Yeah. Uh, we were discussing the design. Mm. First I wanted a diamond stitch just to go straight. Oh, on, the, on the center. And then yeah. Chip with his idea came with the the diamonds Cause. going across. Mm. I want to keep it as simple and elegant as possible. As possible. Just to um, because it's my type of the way I like to do it. Yeah, more simple. Yeah, more simple, not, not yeah. too much. Yeah. But nice. um, I guess my personality is not so expressive. Yeah. So, a bit more elegance within the car. Yeah. 
Before this, it was a, I did the interior, the friend of mine also did it, but uh, decided to change it. It was okay. also like a brownish color, brownish more towards a orange, brownish. When you see it in the sun, it's like orange. Mm. Uh, so I decided. So depending uh, on the light, it, it, yeah. it changes color. So I decided to change the, the interior. Yeah. Uh, also, one of Chip's ideas was the fiber going on the, on the mat. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh, that's well, when I, this was a surprise for me when he, after he was done with the car. Yeah. I put the five ring coins on the head. <laughs> yeah, and I then, know. Uh, Let's see. Brown carpet done through the whole car. Throughout. Yeah, also on the roof lining on the hard top was done. Yeah. So yeah. what inspired your, your, your selection of the color, the, the brown, of the interior? The, the brown and brown, I like brown colors. Yeah. Brown and white, mm -hmm. it always looks good. Yeah. Um, the color of this vintage leather brings out a pop. Pops out of yeah, 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 yeah. It's a little bit of a tracks a lot of um, um, attention and you know, also simple subtle. It's, also some, it's, a, it's a subtle look. Yeah, definitely. It's a subtle look. Something that's very interesting as yeah. well as the steering wheel. Yeah, this is a naughty steering wheel. Naughty steering wheel. Yeah. Part of the reason why we chose brown. Yeah. Because I wanted it to obviously to match with the whole so theme. so so match with the yeah. you know mix your browns oh, in the car. That's sick. That's sick. And do you know Very maybe the size of the diameter of the? No, I don't. But it's quite small, yeah. small. Yeah, very <laughs> quite comfortable to drive. Uh, yeah. Old drive. Yeah. Nice. Something rare you see. Something on this, rare. On this car, yeah. It's not something that you see all the time. And also it keeps uh, the, the old school feel on it. Old school feel, definitely. Wooden, wooden. Wooden uh, steering. Yeah. 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 Too nice, too nice. So we put the took the I took the original radio out. Okay. Put the in dash in the Spine in dash. Yeah. Um basically yeah, this is from your M5 badges. The on the yeah, seat, yeah. That's yeah. this badge is your M5 it comes from the M5. Alright. The Madala M5. The Madala M5 yeah, from those ones. Um, I put it on all four all four uh, seats. All four seats. Yeah. This here is your wing deflector. Mm. This here is essential. Yeah. When you're driving on the top down, the top down. Wind. yeah, and it looks and clean, clean, clean. Yeah, a lot of extras, yeah, have been, have been yeah, not, not a lot though, it looks a lot, yeah, it makes, it makes the car look like it's a two seater, yeah. yeah. So, is yeah. this like uh, original for, from all this the convertibles? This is original, nice. Uh, I don't think you'll get replicas of us unless yes. you can make one, yeah. But yeah, this here I bought from this actually. You know, parts are hard to find. Yeah. So this actually from someone I got from in Housebreak. Mm. Trustworthy because I took a chance by, as I found on uh, your Facebook market, yeah. selling this. And I sent him the money and he sent it through. He sent it through. So yeah. thank God. Thank you, Jesus! Get he actually pulled this through. world. Yeah. <laughs> so he pulled yeah, through, and he came through. And it's actually quite um, still in good condition when definitely. I got it. The netting on it the is still. Is still, yeah, it's still oh, very good condition, actually. Still good condition. Yeah. And we know we have something in the boot. Yeah, we have two tens. Two tens. Hurts. Hurts. Yeah. And how do they play? Do you enjoy the... You know, I enjoy it. It's, yeah. uh, it's, it doesn't bang too hard. It doesn't bang too hard. I don't want... Uh, something that's not... I don't want something too loud. Because especially when the top is down, you can hear everything. Yeah. Put the hurts right through the whole... The, the whole mirrors, car. Your tw uh, tweeters. Tweeters as well. Everything in the car is hurt. Nice. Yeah. Very, very... Also very done by Chicano's also Customs. Also Chicano's Customs. Yes, installed. Damn. So everything you see here is done by Chicanos. By Chicanos. In terms of uh, your air, yeah. your interior. Interior. Yeah, yeah. Then are you planning on, on, on doing something maybe to the motor or? No, I'm not planning to do anything on the motor. Yeah. I'm gonna keep, I'm the gonna car keep it the way as, as, as possible. I don't want to fiddle sense. where. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where I don't need to. Yeah. I'm not a guy of speed, like I said, but uh, yeah. So yeah. the car I call we call it Sky. Sky. The Sky, this number plate is uh, famous from around here because of mm. not the way the car looks, yeah. but because of the owner of the car. Yeah, of the owner of the car. Zane. Yeah. yeah Zane Musa. So he car. was inspired to buy this car mainly because of the plate. Mainly because of the plate? Yeah, Sky. Because Damn. Sun knows his nose, the sky is the limit. Yeah. So when he saw the car, when he saw the plate, it's like this is meant for you. Perfect match. Perfect, Perfect match. match. So he, uh, ah, that's so this is what inspired him the most to get the car. This is why he bought the car. Mm. So he kept it this way. So wherever you drive in, the Tora, Atrich Velma, Melody, Shoshanguve, Yastras, when they see the play, they know who's Sky. Yeah. Oh. They'll just see the change, mm. but they know how this car is. It's the same car. Yeah. yeah. Ah, that's sick. Yeah. Nice, sick, sentimental story. Yeah. I yeah, know, of course, this guy's mm. sentimental, it will never be sold. Yeah. Not planning. Uh, God willing, yeah. the car stays like us. God willing, nothing happens to the car. Yeah. 
But yeah, it's, it will always be uh, something I'll never. It's something that's gonna be even part what of the I, no matter what offer comes, I'll never never sell it. Never, never even consider it. Nah, if, maybe the day I die, my son wants to sell it. That's fine. Yeah. But but you're not planning. For as long as I'm alive, it won't yeah. go anywhere. <laughs> nice, nice. Yeah. nice. And I thank you, thank you for that. Um, are you gonna give us that uh, spin that we were talking about? Yeah. The spin? No, no spin. No spin. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm, oh, I'm the, drive, like the, the drive, the drive. Yeah, we can, we can drive around. No spin. All right, all right. Okay guys, we just stopped by for well to check the tire pressure of the car. Uh, but yeah, otherwise the ride is quite smooth. You wouldn't even say that this car is this low, but damn, it rides super super smooth. So yeah, we're just gonna check the tires now and then we're gonna go out for a drive. So ZD, is there a reason why you always check your tire pressure when getting out? Yeah, because uh, it's fresh tires, right? so you find it when you drive in the tires with pressure and stuff. So, right. just to avoid uh, the tire from deflating, deflating. The, yeah. the wheel. You always I have did to keep checking. with the Napiers. Yeah. So, as I was driving uh, the Napiers, uh, the tire just popped off the wheel. Popped off? Yeah, like it just comes off. Damn, yeah. Euro. And that's dangerous. Yeah, that's dangerous. So, so it's key to the stretch, your stretch tires, especially your split wheels, is a three phase mm. split wheel. So yeah, you always need to, you need to and, keep uh, check of them. Basically, yeah? whatever the three phase wheel, maybe you have to take it off, take the face off, see where the leak is mm. coming from, or whatever it is. Yeah, but at this point, I am not willing to do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'll just bump the tires. And then yeah, I need to get the how often do you like take your car for a drive? Is, is it a... This car will drive um, like for example in winter. Yeah. It will start maybe twice a week. Twice a week. Uh, and so, that's two months, three months. Yeah. So, um, mm. The last time I was with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was yesterday. Yesterday? Alright. Today now. So I probably won't drive it again until I have to. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. But yeah, drivers come maybe not even once a week, maybe once in two weeks, once in two once weeks. a month. Yeah. Uh, let's see. You really drive, you really see it on the road. On the road, yeah. This is a way of appreciating the car more. Yeah. Also, a way of maintaining the car. Yeah. But also, it's also good to see the car to stand for so long. Mm. Well, this car, especially these cars, you need to drive it. Yeah. And then, you know, yeah. even just start yeah. the idle for 50. Yeah, so, and they switch it over again. Like, yeah, I may, I may 
make sure it gets driven, but yeah, it really gets driven. Really so you deal other cars and then this is just yeah, your, this is your, your just escape car. Yeah, this is just a car and then I feel like I want to take it out. Yeah. Nice. Uh, always want to feel like I want to take it out, but <laughs> yeah, can't, can't always take it out. Yeah, so definitely. It needs to be like uh, it's, not, it's not for the streets always. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And this car, well, from the drive that we just took, we've been getting a lot of reactions to it. So people appreciate this car. Yeah, look, it's all about, for me, it's more about me appreciating the car. Yeah, yeah. More than, look, it's always nice to drive around with the car. It's nice to yeah. attention, but for me, it's more, this car is You're not really about, fishing for, like, yeah, those reactions. Yeah, it's more about what I like. Yeah, and what and you I, feel. For and me. I feel like, um, for me, it's not for anyone else. Yeah. Whether you like it or not, it's, yeah. well, it's based on your opinion. For yeah. me, in my opinion, it's what I like. Yeah. I think that's you what it is most. Definitely. Especially for everyone who ever else likes cars. Yeah. And they cars. yeah. I feel like something you, you should appreciate. Definitely. Because every day it's your money you're spending on it. Mm. True. Money coming out of your bank account. True. Yeah. Um, it doesn't matter what. Mm. Yeah. Mm. You shouldn't even care. You shouldn't even yeah, bother. Yeah, that's why I don't. For this car, I wouldn't, I wouldn't enter shows. I don't feel the need to enter yeah. shows. Mm. Um, it's a competitive mm. thing. Yeah. And this car is not for me. The way this car was done is all about competing. Yeah. It's more of you. It's more of me appreciating yeah. and what visualizing what a car always wanted it to be. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah. That's what it is. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, Ziri, bro, I'm in love with your car. It, it, it's too clean, it's too clean. And the story behind it also is is, is, is heartwarming as well. Short, man. I'm I sure everyone's gonna yeah, like that story. It's too sentimental. I wouldn't I wouldn't have done this because you're nice guys. Yeah, nah, nah, thank you. <laughs> and you showed interest in this car. In the car, so yeah. I want one to to, to, to be in front of the camera. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I really appreciate it. They really, really appreciate it. Nah, no, Ziri, well, uh, thank you for, for, for the ride in the E36. No uh, stress, bro, any time. The ride was proper, was the, the story was very nice. Glad you liked we it. We enjoyed it, every, every single experience on the car. Glad um, you liked it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you have a few more cars that you, well, we didn't touch on. Um, would yeah, you care to mention maybe only every, a few? Uh, I'm, a, I'm a VW fan, but every VW fan is a BMW, BMW fan. Yeah, yeah you know the same. <laughs> yeah. Whatever the same goes. Yeah. yeah I have a VR6. A VR6? A red one. Yeah. I have a Polo C. Polo, Polo C. Polo C, 1982. 1982. Mark, MK2 model, yeah. Oh, this is the one, guys. Yeah. Guys, I'm sure, I'm I'm so certain that you guys have even seen this car before. I am certain. Yeah. yeah. So this it, is it's a rare, it's a rare kind from what I know is uh, in the country there's only about three of them. Only three. From the information I got, I don't yeah. know how true that is. But yeah. yeah. This car is a 1.3 liter. 1.3 liter. Uh, the, what you saw there is uh, well, the color of the car is it is more bought it. Yeah. Previous owner took very good care of this car. Yeah. Uh, very well maintained. Yeah. I don't drive this car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't drive this car. This car is change the wheels on it. Only the wheels. Yeah, I just put the wheels on it. Yeah. Give it a fat look. A fat look. Might it, bag it, 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 it might bag mean, it someday. Yeah. Maybe. Mm. But I don't want to kill the originality of the car. Yeah. I feel like. As is, it's a yeah. swipe. Like it has the, the, the Mark 1s or the, like the old Jetta. Jetta. A lot of people get confused with the Scirocco. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, the old Scirocco's and the Jetta's. Or but this is a Polo. This is a Polo C. <laughs> if you look at the... Uh, I think it's open. But it's not open. It's not open. You can see how dirty this car is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, guys, we are not going to go in too much detail with this one. Uh, this is just a teaser for you guys for when you, you might go yeah. shoot it in the yeah, near future ready, yeah again. yeah but for today today was all about the e36 but yeah uh ziri we really appreciate your your time again uh, for for time, for availing yourself time, many time, many time. So then, yeah well thank you for today short man it was a good afternoon yeah, yeah. Uh, thanks I'll, for everything thank, thank you thank you ziri. okay guys that's it for today's episode i hope you guys like the content on ziri's bmw e36 very beautiful car guys very unique very simply and subtly done but yeah uh, i hope you guys like the content but please make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel and yeah uh, just like that i am out see you guys with the next upload peace